Hey, what's up everybody? Proper Jeremy here, and today we are here to talk about the new James Bond movie and how it's finally got a title. And this one comes from Deadline News, written by Patrick Hypes. Uh, Mr. Hypes, uh, I have high hopes for you. Um, so, the 25th James Bond movie officially has a title with latest... With latest movie? Oh, oh. Wow. Improper! <laughs> <laughs> Off to a great start here. <laughs> With the latest movie returning Daniel Craig as the super spy... IMPROPER! This... Okay, this first sentence is just a mess. <laughs> returning as the super spy to be called No Time to Die. That... Okay, okay. The movie's called No Time to Die. That's, that's, the, that's the important thing here. The 25th film in the Eon franchise part. I know there's like two unofficial films, so I guess we won't count those. The pick directed by Kerry Fukunaga is also keeping its release date despite a couple of on-set setbacks with the UK rollout beginning April 3rd, 2020 and the US bow April 8th. MGM is releasing it. I don't care who's releasing it, but anyways, bond, the Bond thing was uh, revealed on Twitter, I think just today. Yeah, about like uh, four, four hours ago by the time of this recording. Um, in the pick, Craig stars as Bond, who is relaxing in Jamaica when his old friend Felix Leiter, um, I, okay, I guess it's supposed to be a comma there. Improper! Great, this is, this is fantastic writing. <laughs> Anyways, I live right from the CIA, turns up asking for help. The mission to rescue a kidnapped scientist turns out to be far more treacherous than expected, leading Bond onto the trail of a mysterious villain, played by Rami Malek, armed with dangerous new technology. Uganaga also wrote the script with Neil Purvis and Robert Wade, Scott Z. Burns, and, and L337. I don't, and I don't know why there are, are, why are there two ands? Like, you used and everywhere else like this. I don't know why you use the and symbol. Just... Isn't there supposed to be consistency? Impro- But wait a minute. Wait, is- Let's see. Maybe they're like a writing partner. Writing partners or something. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh my god! Improper! Oh my god, he misspelled one of the guy's names! <laughs> wow! Oh, oh, wow. 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 Wow, great great job, Mr. Hypes. <laughs> and to think, I, I had high hopes for you. <laughs> See if he misspelled anyone else's name. A Christoph Oldsman with uh, Leah Sidor. Let, I, now I gotta check to see if... <laughs> Okay, they misspelled that. Okay, they're supposed to have, like, that kind of an E there, and... Oh, that's Twitter. Um, yeah, they just completely ignored that, too. Uh, uh, now, now I feel like I have to check... Uh, there's no comma here again. I, who is this actor? Naomi Harris, Jeffrey Wright. That's, like, way too many names. <laughs> this is some... This is... Te this is shit writing. <laughs> this, this is just shit writing. Just there's no spell check here at at all for anybody. Like no editors at all. Like okay, so this came out at 9:05. I guess the guy had four minutes to write it. He rushed it out. This guy rushed it out in four minutes. Four minutes. And this is the kind of article that you get when you rush out these this sort of like the breaking news and just to get the clicks and you end up with this complete train wreck of an article oh i mean uh, now i feel like i have to like spell check you know all of these people's names most of it i, I don't know who they are <laughs> like well some of them i don't know some i do but it's just man production of uh, no time to die has seen its Share of setbacks, including a sound stage explosion. Okay, and Craig suffering an ankle injury and uh, illness. Okay, uh, wow, wow. 
I just, I honestly just came here to just like give my opinion on uh, No Time to Die. It's an interesting name, I, I guess. It shows like, oh, this might be the 25th film in this official series, but we're not, uh, we're not going anywhere soon. We're still going to keep cranking out films, even without Daniel Craig. You know, eventually, I think this is going to be his last film. But yeah, now it's just, yeah, this, this is just, this is terrible writing. And Deadline, like, this, this is why you don't rush your articles just to have breaking news. You're going to get something wrong. I know that I have gotten things wrong when I've jumped the gun on something or, you know, I've misspoke because I'd rush out to get a video. But, man, I mean, this isn't... <sighs> this just f***ing sucks.